There is a focus on the laugh, TV laugh. We are here today. Thanks for the most support. Thanks for the most support. Thanks for the most support. We are here to present the communication to the Ministry of Finance. So. I'm Nathaniel Esco, Junior, the family spokesperson of Senator Gloria Mususka. We are Senator Gloria Mususka family members. We thought to come here today to officially complain to the Ministry of Justice. As you are aware, Charles Musu died on February the 22 last year. Senator Scott and family member were arrested. They went through the court process. Today, they are languaging behind bars. We, not, we are not here to go into the merit and demerit of the verdict because our lawyer, our lawyers are currently at the Supreme Court handling the issue. We are here basically to bring to the attention of the Ministry of, Minister of Justice those occurrences that are very terrible, those missteps that are very terrible. Very terrible missteps that are associated with the case. The police lead investigators after the verdict was given. Maru Dennis went on Hot FM and Maru Dennis indicated that those charges were manufactured against Senator Scott. Maru, Maru Dennis further said that they were political, they were politically manipulated. An indication that Senator Scott and her family member were not giving justice at the police station. They went to court. The court came down with the verdict. The county attorney and the prosecutor charged with the case, the county attorney charged his colleagues for embezzling $150,000. Mind you, Maru Dennis, who said that they did not handle the case, they were politically manipulated. Maru Dennis worked with the Ministry of Justice. Maru Dennis worked squarely with the Ministry of Justice. He was a police lead investigator. The county attorney who accused his colleague, according to him, $150,000 was, was given to them to change the venue. The venue was not changed. The venue was not changed. We didn't start that far. It didn't start that far. They started accusing one another. Adolphus Canoa referring to the county attorney at Wunder Beast. Even one of the prosecutors also went on Spoon FM and indicated that they received $200,000. Maru, Maru Dennis also went on. School FM, I wear this hot FM. And he did say, look, we, the case was politically manipulated. There were big hands involved. Uh, Gloria and her family members should not have been behind that. It was after the verdict. Was, it was after the verdict. After the verdict, people from the Ministry of Justice were coming out accusing one another. People of Ministry of Justice coming out telling the librarian people, telling the rest of the world that the, the, the manner in which they conducted themselves was wrong. They didn't start that far. In 30 years this year, criminals intruded into Senator Justice Scott House. Those criminals, the community came out on them. And through the intervention of the community, let me use this opportunity to tell the community to pure thank you. Police were called in and those people were arrested and they are calling it behind bar. But the, terrible, the most terrible thing is that the very people, the, those very elements within the police and the Ministry of Justice are still here. Could you imagine the police went to Senator Scott's house, arrested the people and jailed them, prepared a charge sheet. Senator Scott, who is the private pass prosecutor in the case, they didn't even rescue her, they didn't even call any of her family members name. Even the location of the place was not a uh, measure. Once the very prosecutor went to work 
and and derive a figure for the stolen items. For what was stolen from the house? They derived four thousand dollars. How did they derive the four thousand dollars? Who did they contact? Does the property belong to the government of Liberia? Of course, no. Of course, no. The property belonged to Senator Scott, but none of her family member was contacted. They derived four thousand dollars as the charge. The next thing, the charge sheet, the charge sheet, her name is not measured. Her name is not measured on the charge sheet. The other minister of justice is not aware. Of all this, because he's just coming. Our intention is not to go into the memory and demary of the case. The people who went to our house that day, they took keys from them. The premise upon which Senator Gloria Scott and her family member are languishing behind bar today, the prosecutor said, no broker, no intrusion. This time around, they put it back in. According to them, charge it between before them, they use keys. Where did they get the keys from? Where did they get the key from? On the night of Charles' death. We vividly recall, from the memory, vividly recall her saying, somebody make a statement, get me the keys. Today, the case is before the Supreme Court. But we have come to bring to the Minister of Justice attention. These things are happening. These things that are happening. The same prosecutor, the prosecutor should be behind bars on them. They should be before the anti corruption commission. $150,000. Leave the measure of the former solicitor general, Nyati Twine. Nyati Twine was called at the, mini, at the temple of justice overnight, attempting to bribe jurors. Attempting to bribe jurors. He was fined $250. And removed from the case. Like I said, look, the one hundred and fifty thousand dollars, all indication, for all indication, was used to bribe the jurors. The family member clear. We are clear that the Ministry of Justice is the Attorney General of the Republic of Liberia. Everything that is happening is the result of misstep on the part of the Ministry of Justice, beginning with the police. Beginning with the police, the police work with the Ministry of Justice. We try to bring it to your attention. He has the constitutional responsibility to act. We're not going to go into the merit and demerit of the case. Today, our mothers, our sisters, language, our grandmother, language in behind bar, the false charges. When the very people manufacturing charges when the very people are still criminally manipulating to allow the recent intruder to go with impunity for us we want the perpetrator we want the actual perpetrator a child of Muslim to be brought to justice their attitude for all indication the significance of data measuring uh, Justice Scott knee on that document, did not refuse the community. It's a clever attempt for the current defendant in the fourth intrusion case to go with impunity. That's, that's the entire that, that's the, that's the entire significant. We want to call on the Minister of Justice to act. He's the Minister of Justice of the Republic of Liberia, and the Constitution gave him the authority. You can have. Criminals. You can't have criminals languaging at the Ministry of Justice, meeting injustice against people. Why you will not put Senator Justice Cardney on the charge sheet? Why? Why you why you go to a house and derive the price for what was stolen without reference to any family member? The motive is in essence. It's clear that they came out her yesterday. So our being here today as family member is to bring to the attention of the Minister, Minister of Justice, the Attorney General. We try to bring it to the attention. He's the Attorney General of the Republic of Liberia and we want to put a squad on his feet. 
The main step in violation started with the police. The main step in violation extended in the in the ministry itself by, the, by these prosecutors. Until we read it out, until we take the necessary action, there will be problem. That's why we are here today. Like I said, I'm not going to go into the nitty gritty details of the case. Our lawyer will deal with it at the Supreme Court. But we have come to bring to his attention all that has been happening after the verdict. So, so, we clear. We clear. The significance of the justice system is to display justice with impartiality. Impartiality. Everybody will have a son. But when you are given responsibility, it is left with you if you are given responsibility as a justice official. Your role there is to display justice with impartiality. Justice Scott and her family member have been kept behind by or justifiably, without any justifiable reason. This is a calculated attempt to allow the perpetrator, the actual the perpetrator, to go with impunity. The Ministry of Justice must act. The Ministry of Justice must act. That's why we try to bring it to the concern of the, of, of, of the Minister of Justice. The best thing they can do is to conceal and open fresh investigation to this matter. The best thing they can do, Maru Dennis, who you made your lead investigator, came out and told you clearly. Say, look, I want a lead investigator. The entire process, the entire charges were manufactured. The entire process were manipulated. There were political interference into the case. That's sufficient ground. We are concerned by the death of Chala. But the manner it found the wish from the police to the Ministry of Justice are conducted ourselves. We might not have the actual perpetrators. So we came to bring it to the attention of the Minister of Justice making it to act. It's the Anthony General of the country. Those with character and liability cannot be the face of the justice system. Cannot be the prosecutors. They were accusing themselves of stealing. People who steal the Ministry of Justice are to submit them to the Anti-Corruption Commission. We did not accuse them. The county attorney said you stole one hundred fifty thousand dollars. He turned that for. He turned that for a change of venue. Adolfo Canuan said no, you are a winner beast. The other prosecutor said no, I took the city Kathmandu. That's official ground. It means the people have eroded. The prosecutor have eroded the character or morals of the Ministry of Justice. The guy should not be at the Ministry of Justice serving as the face of prosecution. When they themselves are accusing themselves of stealing $150,000, what are they doing at the Ministry of Justice? The first they accused Gloria. Today, they prepare a charge sheet. They didn't even mention her name. So the formula is clear. We hope that the Ministry of Justice will perform a function. We hope that the Minister of Justice will perform a function. He's the Anthony General of the Republic of Liberia. Councillor Twyre must act. Councillor Twyre must It's clear. It's clear. The guy is telling you, what, the guy is telling you, oh, 150,000. The, the investigator, the police investigator telling you, look, we were wrong. So everything is on the, on, at the feet of the Minister of Justice. So the Minister of Justice must act. The significance of win the court is not to manufacture case against innocent people and win them at all costs. No. The significance of the justice system is not for the Minister of Justice to go to court and take money to do us. Our country has a terrible past. And the current Minister of Justice must set the transition. Twelve must be made enough, because the twelve must be made enough to set the transition. We are not begging. We are advocating for the rights of our family. We did not come to beg. No. No need to beg. So I saw you want for the minister to act. 
We want the minister to add it immediately. You can't have people languishing behind bars. We want the minister to act. Let the minister look at a direct charge sheet. Look at your charge sheet, the people, the people that the fourth institution. Why did they leave the knee of the private prosecutor out? Why did they leave the knee of the community out? You can't have criminals. Criminals can be prosecuting people. They get, they got no moral right at you. You must have the moral right at you as a justice actor to act. You can't have criminals that are being accused of 150,000 dollars serving as the first for the Minister of Justice by prosecution. Those criminals who have to leave. You don't have the moral right at you. People who represent the Ministry of Justice in court should be people with moral right at you. Again, the family of Senator Justice Gloria Mususka. We want to make sure that the, our daughter, who killed our daughter, is being brought to justice. But what we see is that those who are behind prison, all the confession and amethyst on the part of the Ministry of Justice, Ministry does not point to them. There is no way point to them. Therefore, we call on the Minister of Justice to act. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>